Good morning, everybody. I'm Dr. M. Santi Kumar Singha, and I'm here to say something about the status of Manipuri peoples living in Asha, and uh, specifically about the status of Manipuri language in Assam. We, all the Manipuri peoples living in Assam dates back to 15th century. Since then, we are here as an indigenous community and we are enjoying all the official facilities of Assam government. Our population uh, is scattered throughout the Assam and settled in more than 23 districts of Assam. And uh, the majority of Manipuri community settled in Borak Valley region and in the Noagao district, Hojai districts and in all other districts we are scatteredly populated. So uh, recently Assam government has started treating Manipuri community as a step motherly attitude as regard to our mother tongue. Manipuri language got their undisputed pride of learning from the primary level in the year 1956. Since then, with the relentless effort of our forefathers, our leaders and intellectuals, we could reach up to the university level. Today, Manipuri subject is being taught in Assam University and some other university also. Our Manipuri language is being included in the eight schedule of government of India and our Manipuri language uh, has got its status in AIR also. There is a department in All India Radio Silchar and in Doordarshan Kendra Silchar also a weekly Manipuri program is being broadcasted. So uh, Manipuri language uh, has got its undisputed pride till 2011. In all the non Manipuri schools of Gorak Valley and in Brahmaputra Valley, where uh, there may be Bengali medium also, Assamese medium in uh, Madrasa schools also, Manipuri students could get the scope to learn their MIL, mother tongue. So, one Manipuri language teacher post was appointed in all those schools. And in 2011, Assam government made one rule, one law by name. Uh, Assam Venture Educational Institutions Provincialization Act 2011 and then it has become an act in 2012 also. In that what they did is that all the Manipuri language teacher post has been eliminated, deleted from the staff pattern. They made one staff pattern that in every school what teacher should be given appointment. So they have deleted the Manipuri language teacher post from there. So while provincializing all those venture schools, all more than 150 uh, venture teachers who's, who were working for more than 30 years, thinking that one day their post will be provincialized or sanctioned, they, got, they didn't got, get the chance to serve as a provincialized teacher. And there is their post has been deleted from the staff pattern. That was a step motherly attitude to Manipuri language uh, in one sense that Manipuri teachers were being deprived from their post, uh, from their service and uh, regularization and on one hand and on the other hand all those students who went to those school are now deprived of learning Manipuri language as there is no scope for Manipuri language teacher post, obviously the student cannot study their mother tongue. So it is purely a violation of uh, that is uh, Right to Education Act 2009. That is under that clause, it is somewhere written that every student has got the right to learn their mother tongue. Mother tongue is equal to mother's milk. So all the community has the right to learn their mother tongue in all the schools as there was provision in Assam government's educational policy. So in all other schools, our Manipuri medium uh, schools are there. In Assam, we have got independent medium of instruction that is in Sheba, under Sheba, out of all those MIL subjects, Manipuri MIL is one of the MIL. It is being recognized by the Sheba and Assam government. So 
all Monipuri students they were studying right from the lower primary school to ME level high school level that they can write their SSLG examination in our mother tongue Manipuri language though they pass out their SSLC examination in Manipuri medium so in college level also in all the colleges Manipuri medium is there in university also independent Manipuri department is there but recently Assam government has declared and announced that only those candidate can get job who can write or speak Assamese language in as Brahmaputra Valley and in Borak Valley, Bengali. So, what is the fault of, what is the guilty and what is the future of all those Manipuri students? Will be in near future? That is, what is our fault? We are Manipuri, we have learned Manipuri language up to SSLC level, we have not learned Bengali, we have not learned um, uh, Assamese subject. But while applying for government job, we have to write in Assamese language. So as government has given scope us to learn Manipuri language up to matriculation, up to college level, up to master's degree, why not Manipuri subject be given as one of the subject for qualifying any interview of Assam government. So right now we are demanding all the Manipuri community, boys, girls, students, intellectuals, social organizations are demanding that Manipuri language should be given a status of associate official language in Assam. Likewise, the Bodo language. Assam government has given Bodo language as an associate official language. So, Manipuri should be given the status of associate official language in entire Assam as our population is scatteredly and dispersely populated in all over the Assam covering maximum of the districts. In 1960 uh, there was uh, a language policy that is uh, Sastri formula was formulated in Silchar there was language movement uh, in respect uh, of Bengali language so they got uh, their status undisputed pride in Borak Valley Bengali is the official language we respect Bengali also, we respect Assamese also, we are not against any mother tongue or any language. We are demanding that we are Manipuri people, indigenous Manipuri speaking people. We have been, our language is included in the 8th schedule and our language has got its undisputed pride of studying as an independent uh, medium of instruction and we have learned Manipuri language, we have passed with Manipuri language. So our students should get undisputed pride to write their in uh, competitive exams in their own mother tongue. That is Manipuri subjects should be included in APSC, Assam Public Service Commission and Manipuri subjects should be given as one of the optional subject in the uh, interview of any written interview of any competitive exams conducted by government of Assam. So for that we demand Manipuri language should be given a status of associate official language the reason is that india government has made uh, a policy that is our manipuri community is linguistic minority community there is one example that in bihar i have learned through media that there is one school where only one single student is there but more than eight teachers are being appointed there but we Manipuri speaking population here in Assam is not like that. Our Manipuri medium schools are running in a good condition. But due to lack of students or due to lack of proper result, you, are, you have no any right to abolish our Manipuri medium schools. Recently, there is uh, the, in Lakhipur constituency, one Lakhipur Kuno school has been ordered to ban, to close down the school. Only the reason is that uh, during the last SSLC examination, this school could not perform well in the SSLC examination. So based on that, why you are closing the school? You can give second chance to the school. That is, what is the fault of all those students who are going to give their final examinations next year? This year, if you are closing the school, then from next year onwards, the, the students cannot continue their study. 
so in this way you are depriving all those students who are going to write SSLC examination in their mother tongue so Manipuri students are now going to deprive from all the government jobs in Assam only the reason is that we don't know Bengali we don't know Assamese and we are not being given the chance to write the examination in Manipuri language to be able to write in Manipuri language by all the future students of Manipuri medium schools please 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 Assam government you should make Assam uh, Manipuri language as an associate official language of Assam. This is our demand. It is our democratic demand. I being a Bhasha Shenani, I being a Manipuri pupil and likewise all the Manipuri citizens who are demanding, who are going to march on the road in demand of this uh, status of Manipuri language as associate Manipuri language. I do support them until the uh, till we achieve the goal we are going to fight to achieve the status of associate uh, official language Manipuri uh, for Manipuri language. In the year 2011, we moved to the Education Minister of Assam, uh, Chief Minister of Assam, up to the Governor that all those uh, Manipuri teachers who were being deprived due to the deletion of their post in the staff pattern just to revive their post but Assam government did not give us chance to those teachers and to us to get that scope of undisputed pride as a Manipuri language teacher. Secondly, all those teachers who has retired from their posts, the post is now remain vacant or is being diverted or is being abolished, we don't know no new Manipuri language teacher post has been appointed in all the colleges and all the schools what this Assam government is doing why you Assam government is treating Manipuri as stepmotherly attitude only because that we don't have any elected leader elected representative to Assam assembly it is also the policy of Assam government date back to 1980s i think there was delimitation in assam once we we had our uh, leader we had our re elected representative only because that we were majority in one constituency but due to this policy of delimitation our monipuri populated area is being bifurcated divided in all small small pieces to many two three constituencies so now we are minority we alone cannot uh, get maximum vote to win as an uh, MLA or even in uh, panchayat level also even in Jala Purishad level also we are minority so again you are going to make one delimitation again in this uh, case also we will be again divided in many uh, constituencies small small pieces our village will be divided in many places so now all the Manipuri people have decided that we will not allow Assam government to victimize all the Manipuri peoples again. That is, we have given our franchise valuable votes to all those leaders, all those uh, leaders believing that they will think of our betterment. In the issue of Manipuri language and in the issue related to all other problems of Manipuri community. Not a single leader, elected leader from Burak Valley or even from Brahmaputra Valley spoke a single sentence from their mouth in the assembly or in the media. So many newspapers are printed but there also we are writing again and again, we are submitting memorandum again and again, we are agitating again and again but not a single word, single sentence is being spelled out by our elected leaders. So what will be the fate of our community? So I appeal all the Manipuri brethren and sisters, all the youngsters of Manipuri community of all over Assam, let's unite and unitedly we must fight for our right and we have, we have to give our answer through our franchise, through our valuable votes in the coming 2021 election. We have to produce our own franchise, own leader in 2021 election otherwise we will be victimized our valuable votes are utilized for their winning 
for to win in their vote but they don't understand the value of manipuri people so this is high time for us to unite and unitedly we must fight for uh, the language for the mother tongue manipuri communities should unite to achieve and to fight for achieving the official status associate official status of manipuri language their brothers and sisters you know that in sastri formula there is one provision that uh, in any area in tehsil or in any block if there is maximum manipuri community is populated in that area we can claim for uh, uh, making manipuri language as in one of the associate official language but we have not demanded till yet till today we are not demanding that we know the provision thinking that okay we are happy we are being treated well but now as our bread and butter is being cut off as the future of our next generation is going to be uh, ruined due to not getting uh, the job of uh, assam government as assam government has cut off the line for getting any government job or they have they are they are planning to make manipuri community and manipuri language in a different way so we should think we should decide and we should um, associate ourselves and seriously march towards achieving the goal of making manipuri language as in one of the associate official language as like bodo language which is being given by assam government so their rise their people their uh, brothers and sisters let's unite and let's fight for achieving the associate um, official language status of manipuri community through this video i draw the attention of assam government honorable chief minister honorable education minister and even i draw the attention of central government honorable prime minister honorable home minister and other related cabinet ministers that please do justice to manipuri community please do justice to manipuri language and please do justice to unrepresented community manipuri community and which is being identified a linguistic minority community of assam thank you namaste